What's going on guys? Let's make sense of this alphabet soup. So when we're talking about Medicare, Medicare claims billing, we're talking about ERA, we're talking about EDI, and we're talking about EFT. Okay, what does all this mean? So the ERA, Electronic Remittance Advice, that is the report, it's an electronic document that comes back into our billing software that allows us to auto post payments. So in other words, it's just like what you would call a paper EOB, explanation of benefits. It's just a payment report. If we don't apply to receive the ERA, we'll still get paid. We can still submit claims, but we just won't get the benefit of the electronic payment posting into the account. Now the EFT, electronic funds transfer, that is your direct deposit. When you submitted your Medicare enrollment, your initial contract, you completed the 588, that is for a uh, direct deposit of funds straight into your bank account. Okay, the EDI, that's the main one that we're looking at right now. You cannot submit claims electronically through a clearinghouse if you don't have the EDI enrollment. Now, depending on which clearinghouse you're gonna use, if you use Office Ally, Ability, Availity, whichever one you use, use their specific EDI enrollment information. And I would say if you have questions about it, talk to your clearinghouse, let them help you because there are numbers, submitter ID and other numbers you're gonna to need to get from the clearinghouse in order for you to submit your EDI application. So just a summary, the EDI is what you need to submit claims electronically. Without it, you can still submit through paper and if you have a Mac portal uh, login, you can use the Mac portal depending on your Mac to submit claims manually that way. But if you're gonna be going through a clearinghouse through something like Office Ally, Availity, Ability, you will need the EDI enrollment. Talk to your clearinghouse, make sure you get the information from them to submit to Medicare. ERA is just the payment remits, allows you to post payment information into the accounts automatically. EFT is the electronic funds transfer, the direct deposit that was set up during the initial Medicare enrollment process, the CMS 588 form. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful. If you have more questions about the alphabet soup we have to deal with, just let me know. Post them in the YouTube comments, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you on the next one.